Hey there, friends. In writing this week, we have been learning all about personal narratives, and we've been planning our own personal narratives. Well, today, we are going to actually write that personal narrative that we've been learning about and we've been planning all week long. Today, we're going to write it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how I would write my personal narrative so that you know what to do when you go to write yours in a little bit. All right. Um, I'm going to do the, the personal narrative that I planned this week, which was the story about what happened when I was camping. All right. Um, I'm going to start out on my first sentence with introducing the characters and also the setting because I don't want to forget to do that. I want to, and doing that first, I, it sets up the story so that the people reading it know who and where the, of the story. Okay, so I'm going to start by saying my friend, oh, my friend, Sharissa, and I went camping at a state park. Whoops. We went park we went camping at a state park. Now, let me check that. My sentence or does that sentence tell the characters? Yes. It tells Sharissa and I and it also tells the setting because that setting is the, at a state park. Now, I'm going to write now about the problem that happens that happened while we were there. I'm going to switch colors um, so that I have that in a different color. Let's see. I'm going to say that there was a storm at night. One night it stormed. One night it stormed. And we didn't know if it was, we didn't think it would be safe if we slept in the, in the tents. So, um, we were scared it would not be safe to sleep in the tent. So, all right, let me take a look back at what I already have written. Because when it when we're writing a story, it's always go back good to go back and reread it so that we um, make sure that what we said was what we actually meant to say. <laughs> Um, okay, so he says, my friend Sharissa and I went camping at a state park. That was I. That was where I told who the characters were and the setting. And then I talked about the problem because I said, one night it stormed. When uh, We were scared it would not be safe to sleep in the tent. Okay, now that was the problem. I need to talk about the solution. What did we do to solve the problem? I'm going to switch to a different color. Okay, um, because we weren't sure that we could sleep in the tent safely, we decided to sleep in the car. <laughs> we decided to sleep in the car. And that is my story. I have, my personal narrative has the, I'm going to switch colors one more time because I'm going to talk through and I'm going to check, make sure I have everything I need. Um, let's see, I need the characters. My friend, Charissa. 
and I, there they are, characters are there. My friend Charissa and I went camping at a state park. Okay, that's the setting. Oh, also, one night, so it was at nighttime. That's also a setting. Okay, the problem I have is that it stormed and we were scared that we would not be able to sleep in the tents. We didn't think that it would be safe. That was the problem. And the solution was, instead of sleeping in the tents, we decided to sleep in the car. So that solved the problem because it was safer in the car than it was in the tents. Okay. Now, what you're going to do, friends, for your... Um, for your assignment today in Seesaw, I have given you a blank sheet and it has lines for you to write on. And also at the top it has a, uh, a square or a box for you to illustrate it. Okay. I want you to think about the story, the personal, personal narrative story that you planned all week. And I want you to actually write it. I want you to write it just like I did. Make sure that you have the characters, make sure that you have the setting, make sure that you have a problem and a solution, okay? And you're going to write it just like I did, but it's going to be your story, something that happened to you. You're not writing something that happened to somebody else or someone else's story. This is a personal narrative. It is something that happened to you. Remember that, okay? I am so excited to hear your stories and the stories that you've chosen to tell of things that happened to you. I'm excited to read those. So I look forward to it. Um, remember to do your best and I can't wait to read your stories.